What you see is what you get, man, by myself. It's solo here. What's your purpose of the camera? Uh, I'm not interested in, uh, I'm, I'm actually busy. I'm on a time crunch here. Well, it's an open public building. It's a public building, right? It's a district office open to the public. Okay, we can come in at any time. Leave, or we will call the authorities. Well, the superintendent's online, but her information is online. Right, ma'am, I understand what you're saying, but what you're not getting is that we have a right to the information because you guys work for us. What's going on, Bay Fam? It's your boy, Bay Area Transparency. We're back at it once again, and this is just a quick video to show how to do it and how not to do it when somebody comes through with the camera. Follow us on Facebook, Bay Area Transparency Official. Follow us on Instagram, at Bay Area Transparency. Subscribe, like, share. Let's get to it. I got me a call here. We got some electric vehicle things. Let's check these out right here. Talking to me? What's up, man? Uh, I'm by myself. Who are you with? Uh, facilities manager for the facility. Oh, cool. Just wondering what's up with the camera and what we're doing. Oh, just hanging out. What are Take you doing? Pictures of everything. Yeah, maybe. What are you doing? <laughs> just asking what, what's happening. What, 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 what we're doing, uh, taking the pictures for. Cool. Cool. Yeah. That's Appreciate all. the question, man. Make it back to what I got going on here. Bob, what you see is what you get, man. I'm by myself, I'm solo here. What's your purpose of the camera? Uh, I'm not interested in. Uh, I'm I'm actually busy. I'm on a time crunch here. I don't have time to to talk and and speak about it and stuff. So it's kind of do, doing my thing here. All right. Mm -hmm. Do, do, do. Oh, he is recording me. We'll get that record. Thought he was slick, but he wasn't. I said, I'll wait till I go in to ask for that record right there. He's making another record here. Trying to be slick. Look at him. Got a good one of them right here. Okay. I don't know why he's trying to be slick like that. So this is, looks open. I mean, the gates are open. I don't see any no trespassing signs on anything. Got it back here. Close them. Get all the license plate numbers on these ones. I got those from the back. I don't need much else on that one. Let's go ahead and scoot on here. Oh, we got a record. All right. So this is like a help window here. This guy walking around still. Hey there. Hey. How are you? Are you here to check the place out? Excuse me? Are you here to check the place out? Uh, yeah, I guess you could say that. Let's get this other mural here. That doesn't work. 
You're good. Go ahead. It's going to take me a minute. Okay, Bay fam, let's go ahead and stop that right there. So Mr. Stocky Stock has been following me around since I got to this complex. He won't leave my side. He's holding my pocket or my belt loop, so to speak, and it's getting really ridiculous. I'm actually getting really annoyed with him, but I'm not speaking to him. I'm leaving him alone, and he's doing the same. But you can tell he's waiting for his opportunity to start a confrontation. He tells me that there's a sign that says I can't go beyond the landing of that stair. I looked at the stairwell when I walked up. There was no sign anywhere that said I couldn't come up. But when he pointed this out, I looked at where he was pointing, and in a very inconspicuous area where it is not easily seen at all, they have a sign that says employees only, meaning I can't go past the landing. So I don't. I stay on the landing. I look at the sign. I stay on the landing. He's getting ridiculous, but he wants a confrontation. He wants to call the cops. He wants an issue instead of leaving me alone and letting me do my thing. Let's get back to the video. Call the police. What would you call the police for, bud? Uh, you guys have a lot of signs up that are actually wrong, like that one right there. I can pass that sign too. Yeah, I can, because there's a public restroom right by, by it. It doesn't matter. You can't just put the signs wherever you want, but it's not the way the law works. So call the police all you want. You can waste the resources, but they're just going to tell you they can't do anything. So. You can't have employee, you know, just put employee area, employee area everywhere they want. This is a public building and that's what they don't understand, right? So, on top of that, I'm all I'm doing is getting the murals. I have no interest in going up there. <laughs> this dude called the police. Hey, uh, Rick, I want you to keep in mind you took some pictures earlier and a video of me, and you made a public record when you do that. You can't erase those. It becomes a crime if you do. I'm going to request them off of your phone, okay? Thank you. So this is confrontational, confrontational, Rick. I'm just, I, I know, you, know you heard me, so just keep those pictures or video, whatever it is. Sorry. Uh, I can help you with? No problem. Yeah, I want to get a uh, do a public records request here. Okay. So. Do you have a particular uh, record you're requesting? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this this gentleman here, I want to get uh, his uh, first and last name, salary, and employee file. Anything that's public record in his employee file. Okay. Um, also, I got him on camera taking pictures and or video of me. When he did that, he made a public record. So I want those pictures and video as well that he took on his uh, phone. Okay. Um, what is your, the time frame you're looking to get all that? I, I well, the law is 10 days, right? You guys have 10 days to respond to it. Okay, so I guess I would need a little bit of information on where to... No, I'll, uh, I'll come back in 10 days. Oh, yep, I'll come back and pick it up in 10 days right here, I guess. Cool. Hmm. Oh, look, he's moving the he's moving the sign. Nice. They they took they took my advice. That's the fastest I've ever seen that happen. Uh, I'll be back in one second. I want to watch this sign be moved to hopefully the right place. Are you moving this one? No. Oh, it should be, it should be moved. So this I thought he was moving this sign. He was up there uh, with the uh, little impact driver. Um, this sign needs to be moved down there past the public restrooms. 
um, cause you can go to the, uh, you can go to the public restrooms, right? And Rick was so fast, you know, call the cops. Like for what? You got a guy with a camera. There's no reason to call the cops. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not supposed to be. All right, so I'm just back. To make sure uh, employee name, position, and, and their annual salary was that the request? Uh, his 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 name, his salary, and his uh, person, his employee file. His his file. Any public records that are in his file. I want those uh, those records. Yeah, on his phone he took some uh, photo and video, so I just want to get those as well. Um, and I've already advised him that they're public record, not to erase them. So he has that. And whether he wants to listen or not, that'll be up to him. But um, and then we'll get his email address uh, the for the uh, school district or for the uh, county office of education. Um, and then um, if if he is supplied, I don't know if he is, but if he is supplied by this office a cell phone, I want that cell phone number as well as um, the last three months of cell phone bills for that cell phone specific. If it's, if it's the, the phone that you've given Correct, it's yeah. Phone, I can't get that, yeah, because that's personal. Well, I can get the pictures and video even on his personal phone because he's on duty and he took them, so that's a public record, but... Um, as far as the bill goes and all that stuff, I can't get it if it's his personal phone. Yeah. Okay. So. All right. Have these prepped by the 25th? Yeah, the public records that gives you guys 10 days to respond, and then I think there's an extension that's in there. I think it's like another five or 10 days if you guys needed it. I'll come back and check in 10 days. If you needed the extension, I'll come back in another five or 10 days or whatever. And then, um, so my name's Mike. Cool. This, so, you know, when you do come back, you could ask for me. I'm not typically at the desk, we rotate. Okay. I work in the human resource department. Cool. So I'm on this floor. And I'm available most of the time. Okay, so cool. It probably makes sense oh, okay. for me to help you. It's like, I keep doing Cool. That makes sense? Works for me. Okay, so we'll get that prepped. And um, I guess that's it. I don't know. Yeah, that's it for now. Okay, I've got this person here, so if you wouldn't mind, let me just check and see. Can I help you? Yep, see? do your thing. Yes. Hi, I'm here to meet with the superintendent. Oh, that's a nice shot. Nice pictures. Thanks. Hello. Hey, how you doing, man? That's awesome. You? Good, hey. good. How about you? All right. How you doing? I'm Brent. That's Nora. How you doing? Awesome. Good to meet you. Need any business cards or anything like that? Uh, no. Right. I'm good for now. Appreciate cool. it. Well, let us know if there's anything you need. All right, we'll do. These are our public areas here in the front, and it goes down to that door. And we have a board room in there so I can take a picture too. Yep. Right. Appreciate it. What's your name? Uh, I don't give it. All right. It's a nice name. I'm Brent. <laughs> All right. Cool. Thank you, Brent. Yeah, sure. That's it. Hi, I'm Steve awesome. Kulik. Uh, germs. I don't do germs. Thank oh, you. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> I touch so much stuff during the day, I don't like to spread stuff. But good, right. good, good, good to meet you. What's your name? Uh, I don't give it. Oh, okay. I don't ever give How my name. I, help you? I don't need any help. No, nope. okay. I'm good. Yep, just checking out your guys' sign here. I think some of this info is wrong, but I need to do some homework on it. Okay. Um, but um, I think that it should say, rather than saying, um, where does it say? No video recording, still photography, or voice recording shall take place beyond the front desk. Is because I'm beyond the front desk already, oh, right? So okay, yeah, so maybe it should say like uh, it, it, other area. other than public areas or something like that, right? Yeah, yeah that way people get it because when you see that, you know, some people, I don't really do it. I mean, sometimes I do, depending on people's attitudes, right? Well, I might test that, you know what I mean? But I know other people, regardless of how cool you guys are being, they're gonna test that, yeah, right? We're in public areas or this point or something. Like yeah, that. maybe just oh, other wow. than public areas, don't record. And, and then, you know, people are people are good with it. We, we can um, definitely make that adjustment. Yeah. yeah, for sure. And we're communicating with our schools and stuff, too, mm -hmm. just about that, too, as we move forward. Yeah. And Entrance lobby. Uh, it's sometimes easier to do things through email uh, in case this person is talking. 
talk to that person or whatever, they can just go over the Yeah, but that makes sense, but... Uh, this is nice. Nice new building. Oh. Well, get this done. Let's start here, okay? Absolutely. All right. Did you need help with something? Oh, no, I'm good. Appreciate it. Okay. Yep. Who are you working with? Let's get this one this way. Mm, that looks like crap. Who are you working with? You're speaking to me? Yeah. Oh, I'm just by myself. I'm not working with anybody. Oh, okay. Hi. Hi, how are you? Who are you with? Uh, just by myself. Uh, and, and can I ask why you're taking pictures of everything? This uh, is a secure building. This is a secure building? Yeah, so you're not even supposed to be in here. Isn't it the district office? It sure is. Uh, can't we go in there to do uh, conduct business and stuff like that? You can enroll your student, but you have to be buzzed in. So we're under construction right now. Um, do you mind leaving your name and wh why you're doing this? Uh, yeah, I mean, the doors are wide open. It doesn't matter. This is a secure building. We're under construction, and we don't let anybody in here unless they have a matter that they need to address. And I don't think you're doing that. Well, it's an open public building. It's a public building, right? It's a district office open to the public. Okay, we can come in at any time. Or we will call the authorities. I don't understand call the authorities for what? I'm just taking pictures. It's a picture. Okay. Oh, this is crazy. So, I'm here working on a story. She says it's a secured building. Let's look at all this stuff because I'm simply just trying to talk to this lady and she just ran away. I don't see a secured building. I don't see anything that says anything about can't come in. Let's see. This says lobby no smoking there's nothing that they can buzz you in from or with and she just that's just wild I don't understand why but there's other people in here with the gentleman with his daughter that I'm trying to keep off the camera so I'm working on a report that I'm doing an investigation. Mm -hmm. I don't know what the reasons are for that lady's lies, but okay. <laughs> I don't think she lied about it. I think she didn't say much. She said this is not open to the public, and it clearly is. So it doesn't make sense. What's up, man? How you doing? Good. How are you? I don't need any help. I'm good. Sure I'm positive. Yep. You are? I am what? Your name is? Uh, what's your name? My name is Larry. Larry, good to meet you, man. I don't want to give my name. Yeah, I don't give my name out. I know who you are. I watch your shit. <laughs> anyway, tell these people not yeah, to act like idiots. Uh, any public accessible areas, you can, you can close the door. You can wander around where the doors aren't open. You can't because it's a district office. What's we that? can We have access to this office. Okay. Yeah, so they can't close the door. This is public. I'm just, I'm staying out of here because there's a gentleman in here with his daughter. I'm just keeping them off camera. Other than that, that's why I'm out here. So. Okay. Yeah, no problem. Okay. okay. I will. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to notify the superintendent to let her know what's going on. Yeah, okay. she was she was lost. <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh, that's funny. Okay. Well, so now that people are come, I'll come in. And uh, like I said, I got to keep this gentleman and his daughter off the camera. Just because of... Oh, yeah. I'm trying, I've been trying to keep you guys off. You guys were in here. I'm like, let me keep them off. Here is with his daughter. <laughs> All good, bro. Oh, man. It would have been bad if that dude didn't know what he was talking about. <laughs> what is this? Testing room. Uh, the lady who came out and spoke to me, who is she? What's her name and position here? Um, well, you can look up everybody online. Doesn't, you're not giving me any information, so. Yeah, I, I understand. I don't really have to. The thing is, and I'm being really, really nice about it, mm -hmm. you guys do because you guys work here for the public. Okay. 
And so her name and, and info, all that's public record, and it's important because of the way she engaged with me, okay. right? If I want to file a complaint or something of that nature, I need her information to do that. Okay. So, okay. yeah, I need to get her info, a card or whatever. And uh, I don't know if she's the superintendent, but a card for the superintendent would be good as well. Oh, boy. It takes a lot of courage, and, and, and wants to keep it up. Yeah, for sure. So if you go online, you can get all the information you need there. Gina. Right, but I, I, I can get it here as well, and I need to uh, access that. Okay, hang on. So they're going to keep up the ignorant behavior, I see. Okay, so can we get her name and uh, Gina, position? I'm sorry. You uh, can look online. You can make a complaint online. You can mm -hmm. I can all, do all that in person as well, and that's what I'm trying to do. Yeah. So I think she's misleading you, saying I'm getting a, trying to get a reaction. I'm being very nice and calm. I could get a reaction, but I'm not doing that. I'm just trying to get information that we have the right to. Okay. So um, if you guys don't want to give it, what I'll do is, and, and make you guys do a public records request for me right now and write it down. Mm -hmm. And then you'll have to give me all the information anyways. Do you want to leave so. your name and number? No. No, I just uh, should be able to leave here with the information or I'll do a public records request and get much, much more than what I'm asking for. So just need that lady's name and position and the superintendent's information so I can file a complaint with the superintendent. Well, the superintendent's online, but... Her information is online. Right, ma'am, I understand what you're saying, but what you're not getting is that we have a right to the information because you guys work for us, yeah. and I'm asking for it. And I'm being nice, right? So her, her trying to get a rise out of you guys and all that stuff, her comment is just ridiculous. Like, you guys are trying to get a rise out of me by not providing me what you technically have, what you actually legally have to provide me, so... But I'm telling you, we are providing it by you searching it out online. Well, it doesn't work like that. There's people, what you don't understand, there's people that don't use computers. People I can help that you. People that don't we want to. Okay, cool. Right get, get, find, pull up the information and show it to me. Let's there go. you go. Have a seat at the computer. I'll help you out. Come on. Oh, go ahead. I'll just let you. I'll have you do it. Go no, ahead. You, I'm sure you're very capable of using the computer. Right, but I don't, this is what you're not getting. I don't have to. It's about making you guys do it for us because it's your job. Mm -hmm. It's literally what you get paid to do by my tax dollars. Making you do it for Yeah, you. correct. You work, for, you work for me. Yeah, you work for the public. So, yeah, I'm, I'm forcing you guys to do your job. And I shouldn't have to, really. If I'm being honest, I don't want to force you to. I want you guys to smile at me like the other school district just did. Mm -hmm. Give me all their information. Be real respectful. And then I can be on my way. But you guys suck, so you're not doing that. Oh, I'm just, neither was trying to kick me out of an open public office. Well, I don't think I did that. You didn't, but the other lady did. Okay. And now you're aiding her and not giving me her information, so. So instead of just telling me this lady's name and position and getting me a card for the yeah. superintendent, she's doing all this extra work, coming over here, pulling it up on the computer when she could just say, here, this is her name, this is her position. It really doesn't make any sense to me. I just don't understand it. And what it is, is it's ego and pride that says, you're not going to tell me what to do. I don't have to listen to you. And what they don't understand is, yeah, you're here to serve us. That's literally your job. That's what you get paid to do. You should be doing it with a smile and not making my day harder than it needs to be. So. So here's all the district office staff. Okay, you can just go through it. There's three pages. And that lady's name and position is? I'm um, okay. specifically asking for her. Uh, I, I don't know I'm who she is. and her information, okay? I don't, uh, okay, where is the superintendent at? No, 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 no. You, you don't understand. I have all day. I'll sit here. You, you guys will give me the information at the end of the day, so. Okay. Hi. Hi. I'm Tony. I'm the superintendent. Oh, okay. Here we Can go. Well, I've been asking for you for okay. quite some time here, and nobody seems to want to get you for me. 
and well, I they did get me so uh, well I was literally told no look it up on the computer so okay. well, how can I help you uh, well first off can we you, you should deal with that right when somebody asks for you we should be able to have access to you and they get you and they don't say no look it up on the computer so that's one thing the next thing is thank you and clearly she's not going to do anything about it the next thing is you had another staff member come here and tell me I couldn't be here and I had to leave and I couldn't take pictures in a, this public office you are very welcome to take pictures okay in the public area. so I need that lady's name and her position so that I can file a, a formal complaint with the county office of education and the state office of education I'm not sure who you spoke with she knows who she is and I asked her her name and again she told me no you were told so. that you needed to leave this area I was told that I needed to leave this whole building I had to get up out of here Okay, you're certainly allowed to be in the public area and I, record in the I understand. Public area. I, I know. Yeah, I know. I know very well. But now, because it was taken there, mm -hmm. see, there's a thing in the, in the Federal Office of Education, the U.S. Department of Education, where you guys get federal grant money and reta what they call retaliation for somebody exercising constitutional rights. You guys can lose that grant money, right? I know how to do it very, very well because I've already sent letters to them about other districts. Mm -hmm. um, her kicking me out of here for recording was retaliation for exercising constitutional rights. So again, I'm only going to exercise my right to file the complaint with the county office, you guys, and the state office. But if you guys refuse to give me the information and I have to do a public records request for it, then I'm going to go ahead and take it to the federal level. So, so you were, can you tell me exactly you were where and they asked you to leave? Well, I was in here and out there, and I was literally standing right, right outside this door when the lady walked up, and she said, you got to go. You can't be in here recording. Okay. This is a closed office. It's not public. Mm -hmm. You got to leave. You can't be taking pictures. Okay. That's not okay. true. Yeah. And so, it was rude as well. Okay, I apologize for that. Um, yeah, so beyond this door where it says staff only, mm -hmm. that certainly is not. But this is a public area, and you are allowed to be in the public area right. and record. Um, I don't know who that was. They obviously didn't know. Again, she does. Um, she could tell you the person's name, who it was. She saw her, called her out. And... Okay. You want to tell me who it is? Sure. It was Sabina. It was Sabina. Okay. So uh, that was Sabina Beltran. Okay. And she obviously... Can I, uh, the, uh, the writing of it, can, I don't, I, I, I'm going to ruin that name and I don't want to. Okay. Sabina, I, yeah, I wouldn't even know how to try to spell it. Just like my name you, you okay. is spelled yeah. differently than typical. So. Sure. Blue here we go. And then her position is... Because I'm going to request her employee file and see how many times she's been disciplined and, and all that stuff so I can put it in my story. So Yeah, we don't share employee files, but you can certainly make your request. Yeah, you guys share public records out of employee yes, we, files. We right, so that's what I would be requesting. Request. Yep. Um, what is her position? Assistant to student services teacher. Can you get her exact title? Administrative Associate Superintendent of HR Student Services. Hello. Hi. Uh, is, is Gina here? I'm Gina. Oh, hi, Gina. I, I talked to you on the phone. Okay. Sorry. I'm sorry, what's your name? Enrique. Enrique. Yeah. Keep him Last off. Keep him off. What did we talk about? Uh, the transcript. Yes, I was going to help you sh show you online how to get, I get that. Sorry, okay. I ran out of space. Let me know mm, if you can read it. No problem. Yep. Okay. Okay. Oh, so Sab Sabine. Oh, Sabina gotcha. Bell. Like uh -huh. Sabrina without the R. Like Sabrina Bell, yeah. Cool. Okay. okay, and I will work. Um, and you're the main superintendent. What was your name again? My name is Tony Presta. Tony Presta. Okay. I am per the perfect. only superintendent. Yeah. Yeah. The other ones are associate superintendents. Right. So you're the superintendent. Okay. Cool. Okay. I can find everything else I need online. I'm sure I can get your email and all that stuff to mm -hmm. send this to you. Mm -hmm. And uh, we will s send a public records request if we need to. But I maybe at this point I don't see it happening. So. Thanks. Yeah. I apologize. We just moved into this building two days ago. And so I think people don't know what areas are public and private and all that so you probably threw them but 
Okay. Okay. Yeah, I, I would encourage them to just find out before you, you know, go. T- I mean, the the way she told me and everything. I'm trying. To, I'm being nice as I am to you, right? And I could have said, "Fuck off and get out of here," right? But I don't. I, I'm not like that. So I was trying to be really nice, and she stormed off mad, and it didn't have to happen. Yeah. So, anyways, thank you very much. That's all I need. Okay. All right. Cool. Thank you. Yep. Uh-huh. Okay. Oh, she gave me her card. Gina.